Using algebra, solve the following systems of simultaneous equations. x over 2 plus 3y over 2 equals 5 and 3x over 5 minus y over 2 divided by 3 equals 16 over 15. So what we want to do is to get rid of the fractions. So I'm going to start by taking the first equation and I'm going to simplify the left hand side and I'm going to change the right hand side into a fraction and when I've got a simplified fraction on either side I'm going to cross multiply. So 2 is going to be my common denominator and then I can just bring over the x and the plus 3y because I already had a common denominator and 5 becomes 5 over 1. So now I have a single fraction on the left, a single fraction on the right. I'm going to cross multiply. So x plus 3y multiplied by 1 just gives me x plus 3y. And 2 multiplied by 5 gives me 10. So I have x plus 3y is equal to 10 because I want my x and my y on the left and my constant on the right. So now I have one equation. Now I'm going to take my second equation. And I'm going to simplify the left hand side. So I have 5 and 3, so my common denominator is 15. 5 into 15 goes 3 times. And I'm going to multiply that 3 by the numerator. So it's going to be 3 multiplied by 3x. Then I bring over the minus. And 3 into 15 goes 5 times. And I'm going to multiply that minus 5 by the numerator, which is y plus 2. So I've got y plus 2 with brackets around it. And this is still equal to 16 over 15. Then 3 by 3x is 9x. Minus 5 by y is minus 5y. Minus 5 by 2 is minus 10. And this is still over 15 and equal to 16 over 15. So now I'm going to cross multiply. So 9x by 15 is 135x. Minus 5y by 15 is minus 75y. And minus 10 by 15 is minus 150. Bring over the equals. And 15 multiplied by 16 is 240. So I'm going to bring minus 150 over the equal sign. It becomes plus 150. And 240 plus 150 is 390. So I have 135x minus 75y equals 390. I'm going to divide across by 5 to simplify. I get 27x minus 15y equals 78. So now I have my second equation. I'm going to bring it over here. So this is my first equation. This is my second equation. And now I'm going to solve them simultaneously. So I'm going to multiply the top equation by minus 27. So I get minus 27 by x is minus 27x. Minus 27 by 3y is minus 81y. Minus 27 by 10 is minus 270. The bottom equation stays the same. Now my x's have the same coefficient in front. One's a minus, one's a positive, so they cancel. Minus 81y minus 15y is minus 96y. Minus 270 plus 78 is minus 192. Minus 192 divided by minus 96 is 2, so y is 2. I'm going to substitute y equals 2 into one of the equations. I'm going to go for this one. So I have x plus 3y equals 10. Swap the y for 2 with brackets around it. 3 by 2 is 6. 10 take away 6 is 4, so x is 4.